I'm back with another video. Look, I'm in a good mood today, man. No particular. I just woke up in a good mood, man. You know what I'm saying? I didn't edit. I ain't edit last night, so I'm about to edit right now. Not this shit. This is a brand new whole video. I don't know what we're gonna do today. I'm gonna let y'all know now, but I'm going to be recording all today. I'm just in a good mood today. I ain't got no attitude problems, none of that. So I'm about to be recording all today. I'm about to go ahead and edit, read this book real quick, continue doing my job, you feel me? So, I'm going to catch y'all later in the below. Make sure y'all subscribe up right now if you're new, man. God, I'm on the road to on a big thousand, nigga. Big thousand. Go ahead and subscribe up right now, man. We on the road to big thousand right now, Bow. man. I'm trying to tell you I'm sipping my tea on these hating ass niggas right now. Sipping my tea right now. You know what I'm saying? People people would love, they love to see a nigga fail. They, they hope a nigga prevail, man. You feel me? I just sit my tea on everybody real quick. But I'm going to catch y'all later on in this video, man. My bro manifest, manifesting greatness. Daily calmly right here. I know I miss like one or two days. I'm going to miss sometimes when I'm not consciously thinking or I just right, might forget. My bro said this right here. 1K soon manifesting it. And yes, 1K is soon. Appreciate my bro. We talk all the time. You know what I'm saying? Love, man. He always looking after me. I'm always looking after him. You know all this normal breakfast shit. And but wish I got even more crazier. I know I got two intros in this video, but that, ignore that. Cause I already thought I didn't make an intro, so I decided to make it another intro. But I, I leave it in there just to show y'all everybody fucks up. Nobody's perfect. And I'm not gonna be like, oh well, I can't put two intros in one video, head ass nigga. I'm not one of those. Stop. And I just made it, bro. I just predicted like four, three hours earlier. That it was going to rain. I just smelled it in the air, bro. I got God senses now, bro. My senses is getting up there, bro. I don't know, man. I'm on a whole other level now. I got my fluffies on, man. What's good? God! Don't cut me bigger no more to cut, man. I'm back with another video. So look, man. Today, today... Today, today. So today, man, I've been watching. I've been watching all types of, all type exposed videos and all that. It's basically telling us the truth right in front of our eyes type, type business. You feel me? <laughs> all right, chill out, Bella. Chill, chill. So I've been watching like all type of the videos exposed right in front of our face type business, which I already know about 90% of the shit. Yeah, bro, that's what I've been pretty much doing all morning. Doing my job and just learning, you know what I'm saying? Learning, learning like you can, you feel me? So that's all I've been doing for real. Yeah. Yeah. I'm about to catch you on the gym clip because I ain't about to talk about shit and I ain't about to start the whole time. Baby, go. Sonic talk, sonic talk. Cool workout, got better towards the end. I was gonna record, but I gotta realize I gotta stay more focused when I'm working out because getting sidetracked is very easy. And I just wanna get as much valuable time of working out and focus working out as much as I can because that's the whole point. While you come to the gym is to, you know, try to lock in and get focused. And do what you gotta do to get up out of there. So yeah, definitely a good workout. Reckon that half of my body is sore. I definitely did have a good workout. But yeah, I'm gonna catch y'all next clip, bro. Last man standing. Yes, sir. It's midday, bro. They don't want you, bro. She, bro, what she be doing off the camera? She be getting on my nerves, bro. Be sitting there begging by the door, trying to go into another room where they don't want her at, and she gonna just be sitting outside that room all day. But, I'm about to continue my reading today because I didn't get a chance to read this morning. Man, I was watching this thing. Uh, the truth is, bro, bro, truth is, speaking on, I don't trust J. Cole, da, 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 da. He's like, it's a little podcast. 
where he speak the truth and expose a lot of stuff that's going on around the world, not just the industry. So, yeah, I'm going to talk to you all about this for a second. Yeah, bro, it's just like you can't trust nobody, man. They might, don't get me wrong, they might get up for positive energy, energy, positive message, bro. But if they got an excessive amount of fame, bro, and they just got so, so fucking much money, it seems like everybody that got some two things, crazy amount of fame and a lot of money, sold they sold. No matter what it is, no matter what industry it is, they sold they sold, bro. Be careful, bro. Stop listening to these niggas. They all puppet. They all puppets. All these niggas is controlled. Even the, the YouTubers that's too big on this platform. All these niggas is controlled, bro. Stop listening to these niggas. These niggas is just controlled, bro. They just there to get a check, bro. Don't give a fuck if you die today, die tomorrow. They don't care, bro. These niggas all controlled. Don't invest your time, your hard-earned money, and your life dedicated based off of them. I see niggas surround their whole life around cele celebrities, basketball players, everybody. Don't be that, bro. Invest in you, bro. You become that basketball player. You become that successful football player. You become that 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 lawyer, that that top notch lawyer. You you do that yourself, fam. Do it. Live. This this is my advice. All right. Because if somebody will ever ask me what I sell my soul, I say no. But you, that don't that don't apply to you. You live your life best how you see it. And I'm not saying sell your soul, nigga. I'm saying live your life how you want to live it, bro. You're going to have a lot of regret if you sell your soul, nigga. Because I'm not telling you to sell your soul. That's that's something I will not do. That's a must not. Your soul is not worth any price of money on this earth, king or queen. It's not worth any, any amount of money, any amount of mansions and cars. It's not worth that. Your soul is... It's infinite. That's why they take your soul and not part of your earning, bro. Think about that. They don't take none of these rappers part of their earnings and not taking none of their money. They take their soul. Your soul is worth more than any of this shit. Your soul is all you're going to have left when you gone, bro. It's left back with your family, your kids, bro. They, they can have that faith to remember you. That faith that know you, that, that know that your presence is still present, bro. And now you can't have that if you sell your soul, fam. But I'm going to catch y'all after I read this book. I'm going to do a little more talking, a little more watching shit. And I'll let y'all know how I feel by certain things, though. Can't fight the feeling. Dance, dance, dance. I fight the feeling. This nigga falling asleep. Why you eating? Why you eating? Can't fight the feeling. Dance, dance, dance. <laughs> Well, come on. Ugh. I'm a caniac meal. The heart attack caniac meal. The heart attack caniac meal. Huh. About to eat good. I'm not petty. That's why y'all get go. The family kill out the thing. I'm about to kill this and watch some wrestling. I'm not lying. I love watching wrestling, bro. That's all I really be watching for real, for real, when I'm chilling. I'm going to just get up in a couple hours and record, nigga. I'm about to chill, eat these cookies, watch some WV. That's what I'm doing. Oh. Go.